And here's a corner milk. To my knowledge, the major difference Bitter Deacon, Spoons, Abonide, Dan Christian. Fitness, foodies, and the fabulous absurd. From burpees to Camus, you're never gonna know what you're gonna get from your unk, burpee yoga uncle. How's it? And aloha is your unk, uncle burpee yoga. Um, two of our favorite soup in our ohana is the sinagang and also the tomka shrimp. Uh, I'm gonna make both in one fell swoop. It's gonna be called tomka sinaga. No, I'm just joking. But you can see the ingredients I have there. I can and try to do it with the tamarind paste, but too much time. So it is what it is. Let's get to it. It's gonna be an interesting soup. But uh, I find the two is very similar in terms of taste with a few subtle differences between the Filipino version of the sour soup as well as the um, Thai version of uh, the Tom Kosh uh, soup. Uh, obviously one is with cream or coconut milk, the other one doesn't have it. Uh, but there's uh, other differences too, so I'll see if I can make both of them together so my family can enjoy two soup at once. Yeah, it's your un Uncle Burpee Yoga, man. All I do is experiment Asian fusion. I'm from Hawaii, that's where it all came from, to my knowledge. We put everything together and what tastes good sticks to the menu. And that's for the entire palette of oh, the 808 state. If you like it, please like and subscribe. Uh, always trying new recipes. If it sucks, it sucks. So far, it didn't suck, so uh, let's get to it. Oh my goodness. Listen. Mmm. That is so good. One more time. Mmm. The meat that I'm going to use is basically leftover pork, shrimp for the tomka shrimp, and this is for the basically for the soup, right? And yeah, chicken feet is not a popular thing in uh, synagogue or Tom Kostrin, but hey, it makes it up to take good. And obviously, I've already manicured them. See how, how good I did? Veggie-wise, uh, I don't have okra, and I don't have other stuff, but this is what I have in the kitchen. I have the tomatoes, peppers, eggplant, the veggies here, cabbage, and also uh, some... Uh, I forgot what it's called. I know it's called Chinese. I don't have the uh, the tong choy, the ong choy, stuff like that, but it's okay if you get And then this is gonna be for the tom ka shrimp and then some other stuff too. So let's get to it. I'm gonna start. I'm already blanching the chicken feet. The chicken feet, this is the second pot of water already. Just gonna throw it in there. Oh, look at that. Hoo ha! And for instructions, we just throw in the meat. Yeah, they don't, they don't blanch those stuff, so I don't know. This is Filipino cooking and uh, Thai cooking. But they do things a little bit different, so I'm just gonna follow it. And then the gunk is showing up. I don't know. I don't like gunk, so I take it out. I can't handle it. All right, now comes the fork in the road because I'm making two soups. I'm gonna proceed to scoop half of the soup into a pot. That's about half. All right. So the other one, I'm gonna start cooking it by itself on a separate one. The soup is done for the synagogue. One thing I notice is with so much vinegar and tamarind in there, it keeps all its places. They don't fall apart. And I tasted the soup. If you wanna make it more tart, more salt, whatever, more fish sauce taste. But this is actually very good already. It's all up to you and your family. It's so pretty and so fast and easy. 
and now we move on to the Tomka shrimp. To my knowledge, the major difference between the Sinagang and the Tomka is these ingredients along with a leaf. I don't have that leaf so I'll use lemon leaves. But it's the lemongrass, the galangang, but I don't have that. So the closest thing to it would be ginger and also uh, straw mushrooms. And obviously the coconut shrimp. I mean the coconut milk. This is from the soup that's tucked in half. These are literally lemon leaves that I got from my garden. The A, hey, the lemon grass, which is a really simmer. And you'll add in the coconut milk. And there's the coconut milk. Let it cook for a bit. It's been boiling for a while. Now I'm gonna add in the straw mushrooms. It's missing a little bit. So close. My theory is actually kind of correct. Here's the Tom Car shrimp. Oh man, I can smell the vinegar that's coming out of the bowl soup. So on this side is the Senegal, which is the Filipino soup. This side is the Tom Car shrimp. They're both based on tamarind. So I wanna go try it. I just use the same soup base, but try different. Sour. Just like the restaurant. Mmm. Mmm. The tomatoes and eggplants. Yeah, it sets the flavor off later. Good. Now, Tom Car Shrimp. First off, we added the lemon grass. I don't have gun go, so I added peppers. I mean, gingers. But. These are straw mushrooms. This is very close to the taste. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna try the shrimp. Wow. I'm thinking right now who took who. This is so good. Mmm. They're both good. You like fattiness? They're almost like twins, but with a different 
sperm. How did they even get there? Mm. Mm. Oh my. So, um, Uncle Burpee Yoga. Every day be better than yesterday. In all. Mm.